Well, hey guys, Tony here from VTT. Just gonna do a quick video of how a thrust works in a turbo. We're getting a lot of um, turbos that have uh, thrusts damaged by surge. Um, here's a good example of one. Um, this is supposed to be flat. Um, as you can see, it's worn almost all the way through. Um, this is almost always caused on the M54 by a poorly um, working BOV setup or a DV setup that's just not set up properly. Either you have too tight of a spring, you have too small of a reference line, something that is causing the valve to react slowly uh, when you lift off of the throttle. So each and every time you lift, you get a small amount of surge uh, and it really doesn't take long uh, to get this type of thrust wear. Um, the way the thrust is supposed to work is when it's good, it controls all of the actual load on the, there's a preset tolerance here. Uh, it's usually um, between like four and seven thousandths. Um, it's a very small amount. Um, take the good thrust off. Put the worn out thrust back on. So. so now you can see as this war, um, you have you now have this much play back and forth. See that? That's how much these, so this is held in place. So this is how much the wheels are allowed to move because every time you accelerate, it tries to push the turbine wheel this way. And when you lift, it tries to push the compressor wheel this way. So this thrust is what controls that load. So if you're going to get surge, it's slowly going to wear this out. All right, so to continue on with this thrust video, we left off showing you uh, the amount of movement that wheels can have when you get a bad thrust um, or a worn out thrust from, from surge. Um, so how do we know this thrust issue is from surge? Well, there's usually two kinds of thrust damage. Let's get this off here. So if you take a turbo apart and everything is perfect, there's no heat checking, the oil looks good, everything looks good, but you have a thrust that looks like this um, and it's all clean, yeah, it's caused by, by surge because you're essentially just wearing that thrust out uh, when the compressor is trying to be pushed backwards by the surge every time you lift. Here's an upgraded thrust and as you can see it's gotten extremely hot. It's worn because of heat. Um, this type of thrust damage is from a heavy actual load and then whatever type of oil was being used was breaking down uh, and the thrust was damage probably not because of surge but because of a sustained load like on a heavy pull and the oil was not up to the task of taking that load so it broke down and then you got a metal to metal contact there um, so there's two different kinds the one we're focusing on today is the surge because this is easily avoidable if you just have a properly set up BOV system. Um, in the next video, we'll discuss uh, that.